Okay, one more time. Now, this is your homework file. And I think what we may have to do, certainly for November, is cut down on the constant swimming that you're doing. So last time I had you doing Ks. Cut that down to 800 meters or even 600 and four, or 400 meters in between your drills. And I'd like you to be doing at least 400 meters of drills to six or 800 meters of swimming. So almost doing as many lengths of drills as you are of swimming. Now don't panic that you're gonna lose conditioning or even fitness. Not in a month you won't. You may lose a little bit, but I can tell you, if we can get you getting hold of the water earlier, and also getting you in a better biomechanic, biomechanical position, it'll be worth losing a little bit of fitness in the short term. I play this game of channel swimmers all the time. I, I, one of my clients did a double channel this year and she was only putting in a tiny little bit of technique work. And to be honest, her stroke really didn't change that much. Um, so I don't want you to be doing lots and lots of technique as you come into the swim season. But certainly in November, I want you to do, take your foot off the gas as regards volume. Let's get this technique. And if you come back and see me and that, that hand is sweeping in underneath the body, then we'll be in very good shape for next year. And that's a perfect example. That cat was excellent. 